Chapter 19, Part 2, Translation. Il mange des frosties depuis 43 ans. So here we have depuis 43 years. So that'll be 433 years. In the present tense, il mange will be translated as a present uh, perfect. He has been eating frosted flakes for 43 years. That's a lot of frosted flakes. Okay, next sentence. Je ne leur ai pas offert de cornflakes depuis ma dernière année au lycée. So the cornflakes ou cornflocks, uh, a lot of times the S is pronounced because everybody knows it's an American word. So literally, I, then ne pas, not, a offert, that's a passé composé, composé of offre. So I have not offered to them any cornflakes um, since my last year of high school. Now, this is uh, passé composé, and with depuis, that's going to get translated as a plus que parfait. I had not offered them cornflakes since my last year of high school. Je porte des quaquerotes sur ma chemise depuis hier. So here we have a uh, Je porte, is, uh, I wear or I carry, but when you're talking about uh, things that are like clothes, it would be wear. Uh, les quaker oats sont or oatmeal. That's what they use a brand name for uh, oatmeal. Um, so I, uh, and then sur ma chemise, on my shirt, so I think that's big oatmeal stain on my shirt, depuis hier, since yesterday. So with a present tense will get changed to a, uh, a, pre, uh, a perfect tense. I have been wearing Quaker, I've been wearing oatmeal on my shirt since yesterday. Oop, time to change my shirt. Depuis combien de temps mangez-vous les muesli? Now, les muesli, that's, that's tricky because you think, oh, that's probably uh, muesli. But actually, what they call muesli in French, we would call granola in America. Muesli is kind of like the, the raw, uh, uncooked uh, uh, oatmeal and other grains, whereas the granola is the stuff that's been baked with the sugary stuff holding it all together. Um, that's what they eat in France, and they call it muesli. So what we'd call it granola. So here we have depuis combien de temps? So uh, since how long eat you the granola is what it says literally. But we would translate that as, how long have you been eating granola? Uh, 